No other questions. Let me just say one thing because uh, there is a lot of press about the uh, uh, terrible tragedies going on in the Middle East. And uh, I just wanted to say that I feel very strongly that Israel really does have a right, in fact, an obligation to defend itself against terrorist attacks. New Yorkers certainly know what it's like to be targeted by terrorists, and we also know the importance of fighting back. And I really do want to strongly condemn the repeated attacks on Israel and Hamas's decision to break last summer's ceasefire. I think we all had great hopes last summer that people could live together in peace. And uh, that, unfortunately, at the moment is not, uh, not the case. When last time I was in Israel, uh, I did see the attacks of those um, uh, attacks on the uh, Israeli people. I visited uh, Sterot, where the mayor showed me what uh, daily life is under a constant barrage of rocket attacks from Gaza. And I saw her, and I, I heard during that visit, it's come back to me time and time again over the last few weeks. And just as the holiday season shared this year by Jews and Muslims and Christians was shattered when Hamas broke the ceasefire and launched rocket attacks against and mortar attacks against Israel. And I think both the Bush administration and the Obama team have been clear that Hamas must end its uh, terrorist attacks. And uh, I stand firmly behind uh, Israel. And all we can do is pray for a more peaceful 2009. Everybody should have a right to live their lives uh, without worrying about their safety, whether it's safety on the streets from criminals or attacks by terrorists coming in from the air or suicide bombers or anything else. Uh, we just have to find a ways in 2009 uh, to stop killing each other, which uh, unfortunately terrorists seem to be determined to continue to do so. So. Uh, for those of you who are tourists here, happy holidays. Thank you for coming. We love you. Spend some money once again.